and welcome back to research circle the topic for today's discussion is mobile photography now how to get a good picture on a mobile phone this is the topic for today's discussion mobile photography is gaining more and more momentum nowadays so it has a long outgrow the format of tourist card with a with a show places food photos endless selfies and so on so today advertiser advertising art and a uh, reportage are filmed on the phone so the lifestyle trend uh, obliges any photographer to be able to shoot with the camera of his mobile phone no worse than with the professional one so even huge amount of advertising that you see every day is actually filmed on your phone so photos from mobile shooting can be also seen on the pages of various fashion magazines how your no matter that what magazine is whether it is printed or in the form of internet sources its creation is impossible without layout so proper design contributes to a better perception of a information published in a journal by readers so mobile photography that is mobography uh, a young generation called it has opened up the new opportunities for the street uh, uh, street photographers uh now we'll see the important points here uh, that may affect your photography or if you look into it uh, you will get a good photograph the first one is light any photo is a light painting absolutely every details in the frame depends on the light bad light or the lack of uh, it is unsuccessful photo the lighter the better the quality of the photo so the direction uh, steepness power and the color uh other parameters of the light this is something that will help you to make your photograph more beautiful and unique <clears throat> so for example the best time to take the day uh, day to take a portrait is a couple of hours after sunshine and a couple of hours before sunset so for example uh, on a cloudy day uh, you can shoot at any time of the day just keep in mind that Uh, if the sky is grey, it will look grey. So if you don't like it, try not to include in your frame. The next thing comes here is composition. Now composition is a set of set of method for constructing a frame and arranging object inside it. So that is the main task of the photographer to arrange all the elements of the frame so that they look harmoniously uh, with each other and there is nothing. Uh, sus- spiriculous uh, between them. So there are several ways you can uh, do this by uh, using this. Like uh, here, here we have mentioned <clears throat> dynamics, then for uh, for uh, shortening, then planning, then frame. The next point here is color. Now color can solve a huge number of problems in photography. Here are some most unique ideas or the tips for the good picture. Uh like shoot so that good color is already on the source. Now try to reduce the number of active colors to the minimum. Then the picture will look like more harmonious. It is the best uh if there is one dominant shade in the frame. Uh if there are several colors in the frame, try to make each added color qualitatively less than the previous one. do not overdo it with the tiny tiny thing now natural colors as the rule looks better if possible pay attention to the color of each object in the frame now the next one is idea the meaning plays a more important uh, important role than the visual so, so if you have an idea about uh, what you want to convey through your photo then implement it any even uh, the most stupid photo with the meaning is more important and more interesting than the another cute girl on the beautiful background so be uh, be uh, responsible for that so what roles do uh, does photo profession play look the image creation process should do not end processing the shutter button in fact this is the only uh, only first half of the shooting process for many photographers the second part consists of post processing 
you can use it to correct technical uh, issues such as a exposure horizon adding a shade and so on so however if uh, if the source initially turned out to be a poor quality then processing will be very noticeable so strive to ensure that your original photos are immediately worthy after all natural lace will never go out of fashion and even after many years your picture will be uh, still beautiful and relevant so while concluding i would like to say when processing the photos an important role is to give ready made presents take they take all the photos in the same style including the colors of the object in the picture and its background so do this uh, things you will find this useful while taking a photograph by using your mobile phone so thank you so much for watching this video uh, don't forgot to subscribe to research circle channel and, and take care of yourself thank you so much